What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We just sold out 2021 Panini Select Baseball. Picker team number seven. This is a six box break. And again, if you buy two or more teams, you have a chance to win two select boxes. So again, you buy two teams, you get one entry. You buy 16, or you buy four teams, you get two entries. You buy six teams, you get three entries, etc. You only buy one team, you'll not be entered to win. And the top two names will win a box each of Select Hobby Baseball Ship Sealed. And remember, all cards ship. First case of seven and uh, six and seven or seven and eight are and Is everybody's names in the break? It does not look like it Alrighty so Here we go So at the end of the break, we'll see who gets entries into the giveaway and then we'll do the giveaway So again, also number eight is not actually too far off either. I think it was down to like 12, I wanna say. 10 actually, so, I mean, depending on what we hit here, I mean, I'm sure maybe we can try to rally and get the next one going. But uh, like I said, if not, you know, I know we were back there pretty much the whole day. It is Sunday, I'm sure some people are heading to bed at a normal time, so. After this, guys, the only other break we have sold out is, is uh, Stadium Club. Now, like I said, we can bust open maybe another Select. Five Star is down to 10 as well. And then I think after... Honestly, I just I really think it's just the baseball breaks that we can get going tonight. And that's crazy because, you know, usually the other ones are selling. But I think the closest for tonight is going to be either, like I said, another Select. Either Five Star or maybe another Stadium Club. All right, so one, two, three on the left, four, five, six on the right. Two. One, two, three. So these right here will be for number eight. And just in case, of course, I mean, I'll probably most likely be the one doing it, but you just never know. I'm putting a little eight on this. Let you guys know that this is going to be for the next case. Or next break, I should say. Alright, man, no problem. Do what you got to do. All right, guys, so again, they do have color wheels. Those are not per case. Those are super short prints. I, I thought I heard someone say that they were every other case or every couple cases. But again, depending on what cases we got delivered, every one of our cases can technically have one. I know, of course, the only thing that is a case hit is the zebras. And again, in the past, I have seen multiple zebras in a case. So it just depends. But I um, would love to pull a color wheel. That'd be an awesome one to pull. So I'll probably rip open and pack stack three at a time. It's kind of speed of the break just a little bit.
I was, Aaron. I teleported over here. It was great, man. It was awesome. I'll be back next weekend. <laughs> Except next week it won't be for pleasure. It'll be for work. But I'll still have a day, technically, to to be free. But it was fun, man. It was it was nice and hot. The pool was nice. Walked around a little bit. Wish I was there longer, but it was good. Very nice, man. That's awesome. What is that? Sunday through Tuesday? Sunday through Wednesday? I think the 8th is a Sunday, isn't it? So I got three boxes here, guys. Let's see what we got out of here. Austin Meadows. Evan White. Oh, Relic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, you never really do unless you're there for like a whole week, you know? Yeah, I was in Fremont yesterday. I went to go see that. Uh, I went to go see the Circa Casino. Beautiful. <laughs> it's like a sports guy's dream. I am planning. Planning on going for, for me and my wife's birthday again. And then we'll stay one night over there. And then we'll just like... We want to try to stay at the, at the Cosmopolitan next time. So we might do that for our birthdays. To 99, Daz Cameron. I did, I drove right by it. I drove down, I drove down the strip as well too, just to kind of, kind of scope it out, you know? Yeah, I did, man, it looks pretty cool. I mean, it's so funny cause like, it's legit like right next to like, uh, Circus Circus, so like you have the, like the most expensive casino ever built, and then <laughs> you have like Circus Circus like right next door. Luis Garcia. Yeah, the Resorts World actually had just opened up yesterday, or on Friday, sorry. Salvador Perez. We got Anoli Pardes. You got a Daz Cameron Silver. I know, right? <laughs> you know, what my wife was saying was that like people are probably gonna stay at the Circus Circus to save money, but then they'll probably be at the World Resorts like all day. <laughs> oh, Zebra. Randy Arena. Phenoms, Zebra. There you go. No, but the Circus legit, man. That shit is... That shit is awesome, dude. I even, I even uh, play some some Eagles bets, win the division and shit like that. <laughs> Why not, right? Like you can't visit the circuit without placing some bets. Casey Mize.
We got Luis Campusano. Campusano. Yeah, the one thing I wanted to do was a stadium tour like you, but they didn't actually have any of the... Uh, they didn't have any uh, dates available. They're not available again until like next week. Luis Gonzalez, 299. So I'm thinking I'm going to place uh, a reservation the weekend I go to the Eagles weekend. We can go to the Eagles game. And then, um, and then, uh, you know, go do it Saturday and then go to the game Sunday. If they have that available that weekend. If not, then I'll just, I guess I'll just go watch it at the game first. Kristen Pache to 250. Nice, did you really? I did like some cheap. Well, I mean, I didn't do like. I mean, eh, I didn't do like some cheap bets in a way, but I mean, they are kind of cheap in a way, I guess. I just bet like seventy five bucks for the Eagles to win the NFC East. I think the payout's like, like five hundred or something. And then I did some fun ones just for fun. Why not, right? I did the Eagles to win the NFC Championship, and then the Eagles to win the Super Bowl, like ten bucks each. <laughs> it was like, it was like a like a thousand bucks, and then the other one was like, I don't know, like seven fifty or something like that. Mateo the 10 look at that patch for the Padres There you go Going to Willie there you go Willie No, it's true. You never know man. I mean honestly, I I um the year the Eagles won the Super Bowl, I was gonna, I went to Vegas that year, and I was actually gonna place like a twenty dollar bet for them to win the Super Bowl just for the fuck of it, but I didn't, and I swear, like, I would have done it, I would have won some money, just would have been so cool. But I, I mean, I didn't, not, not, I didn't expect them to win the Super Bowl, but still, you know, you just, you just never know, like you said. So, I did, I just did a little bit more for the divisional because I feel like they could actually do that. Oh, yeah, man. Well, definitely when I go for the Eagles weekend, I gotta do some like parlays and just pick them. Should be fun. I don't know. I the one thing I need to figure out is that if they, I don't know if they still charge you to go to the pool area because you know they have a sports book out there too. But um, if you wanted to go see the pool area, it was like forty bucks. It's just crazy. No, that's what I was talking about, the stadium. So that's just like $40 to enter. I mean, I, I was going to do it, but we just went there really quickly. My mom gambled a little bit. I placed some bets, and then we went to the next casino. My mom wanted to go to uh, we went to the Bellagio. Yeah, so I don't know if you're staying there. It's free, but it's 40 bucks to go in. Monte Harrison. Yeah, I was gonna go see it, and I was like, ah, I don't know if me, I don't like, I don't want to spend eighty bucks right now. I can use that towards something else. I was like, if I stay here, then I'll just see it when I stay here one of these times. But I don't, I don't know if if uh, if it's free when you're staying. I'm assuming it has to be right. That'd be kind of dumb for you, like to have to pay still. Jemai Jones, two ninety nine. 
And Josh Bell. I love this rookie explosion card. It's so awesome. Ian Anderson. And we got Alec Bohm. Premier level silver. Phenom's Joey Bar. And to 99, Leody Tavares. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Like, you know, <laughs> I mean, if I'm staying there and I have to pay for it, yeah, well, I'm going to actually, you know, fucking swim. I'm going to enjoy it for the week. Yeah, right? I mean, for the day. But I was like, I don't know. I'm not going to spend 80 bucks just for to go walk in and see it. Yeah, I don't know. That's what I was like. Oh, I told her, I was like, oh, we'll just see you next time. I was like, if we, if we really want to stay here for our birthdays, we'll stay here one night. And then we'll, we'll go back to, like, the main part of the strip after. But yeah, it was really cool. It was really awesome. Dalton Varsho. Anderson Tejeda. All right, third box, guys. Varsho. Tristan McKenzie. Yeah, I mean, shock. I mean, not shockingly, I guess, but man, there was a lot of people like everywhere. And yeah, we we were gonna, me and my sister, we were gonna rent a cabana, but I think they ended up being full. But actually, I think we talked, we seen in person that there was still like a few left, so we ended up just renting like this day bed, which is kind of cool because it's kind of like a cabana, right? like in a way where it's just all yours all day, and it seats like four people, so. We did that, and it was like, the cabanas that we, yeah, this past weekend were like 500 bucks, five $600, and this day bed I think was like 150 So, it was, it was, we did that, and then my, my sister had seen that for the Eagles weekend. I think it's only going to be like in the high 80s, but I'm sure the pool will be still heated, but the cabanas that we were only like $200, <laughs> with like the TV and everything, so I was like, wow. I was like, we'll just do that next time. Chris Bassett. Jesus Sanchez. Damn, that's right. That's crazy. Yeah, I mean, it just depends on the time of the season, I guess, right? I guess right now, since it's super, super hot, everyone's fucking, you know, just using money on cabanas and the pool and everything. Out of 149. Have you stayed at the Cosmopolitan before, Aaron? Tristan McKenzie. Nice. Yeah, I, I, I like Park MGM. I mean, I used to like Monte Carlo back in the day, too. When I was still Monte Carlo. But obviously, they upgraded everything, so it's much nicer now. You know, Italy's there and stuff like that. It's easy to get in, easy to get out. You know, they have that little, like, kind of like how Aria does where they have their own little, like, backways and streets. But, yeah, we want to we wanna try to stay the Cosmo. That one looks nice, too. I might say I haven't even stayed at Aria before, but... One of those two, I guess, right? Luis Campusano. All right, three more boxes. But yeah, guys, uh, I don't have the flyer here. Let me see where the flyer is at. Let 
Yeah, guys, me, Nick, and Bossman will be at the uh, car show in Vegas, inside Planet Hollywood. It's on Saturday, July 3rd. It's going to be pretty fun, guys. If you guys are in the area, happen to go to Vegas that weekend, want to make the trip out of Vegas, it's going to be inside Planet Hollywood. It's going to be legit. I think it has over like 150 tables, so it's a pretty decent size. We'll be buying, selling, trading, and doing some live IG breaks there. I'll be breaking there live on IG. If it's a successful one, they might do it again. Lucas J. Little. But yeah, this will probably be our only um, shows that we'll be going to before the National. Alec Bohm to 25. Cracked ice patch right there. Yeah, I want to see if it's available because I want to say that they didn't have it available until the 7th of July. So, I don't, I don't think we'll be there. I think they were legit completely booked all the way up until, like, the 7th. Because when I looked on Friday, I was like, oh, cool. I mean, would it really sell out, like, you know, a day in advance or two days in advance? And no, it was sold all the way up to the 7th, I want to say. So, it could be it could be that. So, but yeah, if it wasn't sold out, I'd definitely tell Nick, hey, let's do it Friday. Why not, right? We're getting there Friday. So, I figure we can do that before that. But I, I want to say that I, don't, I think they're booked all the way up until the 7th. I was like, damn, man, people be torn. Dude, they make money off of that, imagine. Liam Hendricks. Christian Javier. Me, Nick, and Bossman are we're going on Friday. Going, uh, driving out there Friday. Staying the other one night, and then Saturday's the show. Corbin Burns Green, one out of five. Very nice there for Milwaukee. Going to Josh X line. Check and see, Aaron, if you're on the website. <laughs> if you can for me. Porfas. Jose Iglesias. Sicto Sanchez. Yeah, I do. I have two of them over here. Fernando Tatis Jr. Shane McCallahan. Jackie Bradley. Oh, man, this card is a little... The corner right here is a little messed up right there. Out of 49. And it's not really the... It's not really the full corner. It, oh, yeah, it is. I was going to say it's more like the back of it. But it's a little bit backwards right there. Boston Celtics. Oh, sorry, Boston Celtics. Boston uh, Red Sox. Sorry, Chris Miller. I mean, it could flatten out like this, though. Yeah.
All right, guys. Two more boxes. See, it, it's it's booking up pretty fast. Thanks, Aaron. I appreciate it, man. Yeah, but it, it's booking up really fast. So I think I might I think I might have to like. Well, I mean, I I don't have to wait for I don't have to book it now for October, but I think maybe by like maybe like late August or something, I should start like looking into it and seeing if there's any available that weekend that I'm going. You know. How many people actually are in the tour, like, in your time slot? Because I've noticed they have a sh ton of time slots. So I'm wondering how many people can actually be in each time slot. Do you happen to know how many people were, like, in your little, like, uh, time slot that you want? <laughs> I know, right? Let's do it. I, I, you know, I, I technically could go, so our schedule is actually going to be switching up next week. So I'll be working now uh, Tuesday through Saturday, and then Joe's going to be working Sunday through Thursday. So he's taking my schedule, I'm taking his schedule, basically. Um, so that weekend, I will have Sunday, Monday off, but although the 7th, I mean, technically I could go that weekend, but that's, uh, that, uh... Ooh, Ronald Acuna Jr. X Factor autograph. That seventh, the day before, uh, we're doing like my my dad like a little celebration of life party that we have for him because his birthday's on the fifth. So since we didn't really get to do anything, uh, you know, due to COVID and stuff, like a little like a get together after the funeral, we're gonna have it for that weekend. So, I mean, technically I could go that weekend, but I'm not sure what we'll be doing like the days after. But I'll be calling off that Saturday. So, I'm looking forward to it though, man. It's it's gonna be fun to like see some family, you know. Obviously not for the best reasons, but at least you know we're gonna get him some music and stuff and everything. Twelve twenty five, out of twelve twenty five, sorry, Corey Seager, A little cracked ice. And Will Crow autograph there. And Noli Pardes. I know, man, it's crazy. Can't believe it's already been like six months. I like to think about that, you know? Like, so much time just flies. That's what he used to talk about, too, you know? It's just so much, like, how time just flies. Like, it's crazy. And it's, I just can't believe we're already in June. Like, it's fucking, it's wild, dude. It's crazy. It's like time doesn't stop, you know? Miguel Rojas. Out of 199. And we have a gold Wilson Contreras to 10. I believe that's for the Cubs, right? There you go. Nice little gold. Boom. Nice one. Tatis. Judge. But yeah, the cool thing though, man, is now I have Sundays off. Sundays and Mondays. For watching football now in peace. If I'm pissed off because of the Eagles, then I don't have to come to work and fake it. <laughs> Jorge Ona. Wow. I told you we can have two zebras in one case. Bobby Delbeck. That's a rookie zebra as well. Wow, there you go. Boston Red Sox, Chris Miller.
So, I got box one, I want to say, right? We pulled that zebra. Tripping? I thought I did pull Zebra. Yeah, here it is. Phenoms, Randy Rosarena. Two Zebras in the same six box enter. You never know, guys. It's 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 up. Uh, it's Panini. It could be like such a monster hot case that there could be more. <laughs> you just never know. No, but I, we seen it when we passed by going to there, and I wanted to stop by on the way over here, but there was a lot of traffic, and we just couldn't do it. But I wanted to stop by there. Have you been? Have you been there before? Seems so cool. It's like next to the world's largest gas station or something like that. Whatever it's called. Hey, do you really? So, like, you can get ice cream and all that shit there, right? I gotta do it next time, then. Inside that little, inside the, the Sunday cone, whatever. <laughs> really? Yeah. Oh, hang on the wall. Okay. Gotcha. That's sick. All right, last box, guys. I gotta stop there next time. Though. Ooh, hot rookies. Look at that. It's a hot case, guys. It's a hot case. Gold, Ryan Mountcastle, 5 out of 10. It looks tiny from, like, driving by, but maybe I guess when you finally go in there, it's actually not that little, huh? Keegan Aiken. Wow, another gold, guys. This is, this is definitely a hot case. Moonshots Gold, Bryce Harper, 5 out of 10. Wow. Look at this, guys. All these golds are just popping out. I don't know. Oh, my God. We have another gold coming up. Look at this. Mitchell White Gold, 1 out of 10. Man. That's three golds in the same box. What is going on here? Dodgers. JT Romuto. Holy shnikes, guys. Hunjin Ryu. Ooh. All right, I got to stop there next time. I'll tell Nick we'll stop there this weekend. <laughs> Gavin Lux. Tatis Phenoms. Ha Seung Kim to two ninety nine for San Diego. Padres going to Willie. Leo or sorry, Edward Oliveras to fifty. 
Xander Bogarts, red, white, and blue. Chris Bubik, uh, two ninety nine. I got some regular top loaders that ran out. Damn, really? That's sick as hell, dude. Uh, Clark Schmidt to 99. Red Brian Anderson to 199. And there you go, guys. What a great break. That was that was pretty sick. I'll do a quick recap right now. Uh, let me actually get some regular top loaders. Alright guys, so here you go. Relic right there. Relic, we got an autograph. Relic, Ronald Acuna Jr., Alec Bohm, Jackie Bradley Jr. We had a green out of five, Corbin Burns. Autograph, Daniel Johnson, Tristan McKenzie, Vladdy, little tie-dye to 20. Uh, we got Leody Tavares, Monte Harrison, Christian Pache. Uh... Like I said, guys, th this last box was a straight-up hot case. Uh, ha Seong Kim. Bubik. And like, we have one gold out of ten. Mitchell White. Moonshots out of ten. Bryce Harper. Then we had a Ryan Mountcastle. Hot Rookies out of ten. Wilson Contreras out of ten. Randy Rosarena Zebra. And I told you guys there could be multiple Zebras in a case. And you got two of them right there. Randy Rosarena Phenoms and Bobby Delbeck Rookie Zebra. And like I said, another gold over here. Jorge Mateo. <laughs> It was just so much gold. It was ridiculous. Look at this. Two, three, four, five gold cards. I love gold. <laughs> so appreciate it, guys. This was break number seven. Now let's quickly uh, switch scenes and give away those two boxes of select. So again, if you buy two or more teams, you have a chance to get those uh, get those free boxes. No problem, Willie. Thank you, man. So let's switch scenes really quick and let's give away these boxes. So we're gonna alphabetize by customer name. So Chris, you had two entry. You had sorry, two teams. That's one entry. Jeremy was just one, but no entries there. X line, you had eight, so that's four entries. Justin with one entry, Mark with one entry. Shane with four. Steve, Steve. All right, 14 out of the 15 possible entries. Let's roll it. Four and a four, eight the hard way. Remember, top two get a box. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. And eight. 
Four and a four, eight the hard way. Both Steves won. Steve Moser and Steve Wright. So there you go, guys. Congratulations. So both of you guys will get a box each. And I'll write this down right here so I don't forget. Appreciate it, guys. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com.